Many Houstonians are taking the 4th of July week off, but not Houston City Council and not KPRC2 investigative reporter Mario Diaz. He's here with us this morning working on this fine Tuesday. A little cash, don't you think? I, I am. I mean, you know, every Tuesday I get to wear a suit and tie for this, as I do for most of the time. But we have a reason for this. We're not getting ready for the 4th of July barbecue yet. It's, not yet. No, I have a shoot that takes place here in about 30 minutes. In our business, a shoot means we have to go out and shoot a story. Mm -hmm. So I have a shoot that interviews interviews all day, and it's a sports-related investigation uh, that we're working on. So it doesn't make sense to always dress up. Took off a tie. Yeah, it's like going to the beach in a suit and tie. Although, <laughs> you know, you don't do live. I shots. always love those live. But shots. I did that early yeah. on in my career. Yeah, I did of course. Because you don't know what you don't know. In Clearwater, Florida, I'm wearing like a black suit and tie, you know, and doing a live yeah. shot in the middle of the white sand of the beach. So you kind of learn from those type of lessons. So today, sports shoot, casual day, uh, but we're talking serious. Yeah. Pop off politics. Uh, but as we get into that, I want to, I'm actually surprised that there is city council this week because of the holiday. Yeah, but it, the holidays until when? Thursday. Right, right, right. So, so we Wednesday's still, okay. technically a working day. But there are some weeks that they usually do take off. It's about four weeks in the year where they do not meet. Uh, they spread them out. Mm -hmm. But as you said, Zach, this week is not one of them. All the members will be around the horseshoe as they, well, that's not a horseshoe, that's a circle. Half. There you go. It's like a half moon. Yeah. They're around the horseshoes, they call it City Hall for Tuesday and Wednesday <laughs> for City Council. Yeah. Remember, you pay yeah. for everything in the city. It's your money, our money. And nearly all of the operations. Mm -hmm. So, every Wednesday at City Hall, they're starting to take votes. Houston City Council approving millions of dollars for projects. And we are saving you time every Tuesday morning by examining what is taking place and how it's impacting your family. Okay, mister. What are yes. we talking about today? Okay, well, I'll tell you, it's nearly slim pickings. Because there are only 14 items on the oh, agenda wow. <laughs> this week, with six items coming back because the vote was postponed last week. Oh, yeah, you like and, to do that. Yeah, 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 yeah I know, I, I know. I'm, I'm waiting for like, it. Because the vote was postponed. I didn't say the word. What is it? Tagged. That's right. It means they kick it down the road. Kick it down the road. Uh, and really what they wanted to do was uh, they wanted to get some more information. Before they yeah. made any sort of decision. So we got an interesting, interesting pop-off segment today. Yeah. Because you want to think of it basically in a couple of movies. It's like a movie. Yeah. You got some moving parts here, okay? So we're going to start off with agenda item number 11. Here we go. Let's take a move. Here we go. Approve a purchase in the total amount of $112,000 for couplings from Ferguson Enterprises LLC through the National Cooperative Purchasing Alliance for Houston Public Works. What is this all about? Well, initially, you think of coupling, you're thinking of Gwyneth Paltrow, but that right. was uncoupling, okay? <laughs> <laughs> that was uncoupling. I will tell you by using the city's explanation as to why, this is called the backup, mm -hmm. as to why they are purchasing 260 couplings, eh, a little bit more, all right? Uh, couplings play a, push, a crucial role in connecting pipe sections, okay, you're yeah. connecting, while maintaining the integrity of the pipe. These couplings are used to repair broken or leaking water pipes oh. throughout the city, huh? Does huh? Amy know about this? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> All right, so these items will be stored at the Houston Public Works Warehouse. That's a very common word, Houston Public Works. We've been hearing a lot yes. about them over the last few years and will be used citywide. So why was this tagged? Okay, so why did they kick it yeah. down the road? R really simple, it's like a, let's do that, it's like a chorus line here, yeah? Bam, because <laughs> of amendment sack. It's uh, one word. There are some adjustments that needed to be made to the language. They wanted to examine mm -hmm. it a little bit more, which will be discussed further today and probably voted on tomorrow because it appears that there's no one else that can really tag it. But however, no real explanation was provided to this point. I mean, when I watched city council last week, it was just like tag, tag, and a little discussion. They need to get some more information. Interesting. Yeah. It well, it's interesting, like too, that we're talking about this again because so often we've been talking. How many years have we been on this? Public on works. It, right. I mean, Public works and how much is needed to Houston. fix the infrastructure. Yeah, it's the city of Houston, and you're right about yeah. that. And, and this was another motion that was tagged or postponed by a city council member. It's a recommendation. Here it is. We got another one. Where is it? Oh, I thought it was there. No, it is. It's right there. Oh, there it is. Uh, forgive me. We're doing a little bit more of a dance this week. <laughs> it's a recommendation from the Chief Procurement Officer on award to Coburn Supply Companies, Inc. for purchase of fittings to, uh, and other tools for the uh, couplings, again, not one of the patrol, <sighs> for Houston Public Works for three years with two one-year options priced at $4.6 million. And according to the city's reasoning 
for that is because of the purchase of 260 uh, couplings. Couplings play again a crucial role. Yeah, that crucial yeah. rule in you know connecting everything as they're discussing. Okay, all good in information. Terms of making it all work. Making it connecting it. That was a great way to put it. Yeah, as you did. So there you go. So what are your plans for the holiday? Are you off? Are you here? Uh, you know that's a good. Idea. Hudson, we got a bar Hudson's here today. Come on over, Hudson. Get hey, over Hudson's here. over. He's put, well, can, he's, can he come on, Dad? Yeah, yeah, he can. I get okay. Come on, bud. You want to come on? What are we doing on Thursday? Ball tournament. Baseball? No, what are no? we doing on Thursday? He, he doesn't know. know. We're going to Harrison's <laughs> house. His best friend is Harrison. You got to over here. Come over here. You got to come over here. This is Hudson. Hudson, he's a chip off the old block. He already questions me, so that means that he's going to be hey, questioning people. Hey, we like to hear that. Somebody's so, got to question this but, guy. But we're talking on the investigation. This is why I'm dressed like this. Yeah. This is what the story has to do with today. Of course it does. It has to do Oh, I think I know. I oh, think I know. Okay. That's a hint. Yes. And, you know, we are one of the top baseball. Okay, you can go. You want to talk politics. Well, no, I, I wish. No, come, 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 come here, come here, come here. Come you're going to do, we're going to, you're going to end this break. Because your right. dad always messes it up. I guarantee you, you won't mess it up. All right, well, really fast, I'm just going to say this. You want to talk about politics. And you, you go to a, you go to a select baseball tournament game. And yeah, oh, yeah, right. Yeah. Oh, that's where it you gets the, real ugly. You were at the gymnastics. Yeah, and by the way, oh, great man. job this past Thank week you, at the Olympic trials. That. Thank but you. you know, parents, oh, absolutely. and we're talking about this. That's yeah. what this investigation's about. It's Brings very me back to my father. Right. Okay, so listen, buddy. Hey, we're, you're going to help us with this. I know you don't have a mic on, so I'm going to stand real close to you. Mario is as well. So we're going to have you read this. All right. As always, he's Mario Diaz, and again, the segment again is Pop Off Politics. We do it every Tuesday around this time, and Mario, how can they directly connect with you? Well, that's real simple. You just have to read the next part. I see. So I even said real This simple. is the part that he this is. I always mess this part. Let's see if you get this. Real simple. Um, Mario Diaz. <laughs> <laughs> Told you the chip off the old block. They're like, yeah. actually, but uh, hey, great job. It's actually M Diaz at kprc2.com. M Diaz, okay? But you know the rules. Don't email dad while he's at work. Yeah, right. Okay? <laughs> Thank you. Thanks Thank for you, coming. In. So we have to get going because I got to get him to the to the, to the location. Okay, too. get out of here. It's summertime. Oh, get. You know. Oh. It was nice seeing you. Hey, always. <laughs>